Hi there, I'm Brian Loudenslager, founder of Loudon Audio, and I'm here today at Soundpure to talk to you about our new Atlantis FC387 large diaphragm multi-voicing condenser microphone. Uh, this microphone was designed in conjunction with Fabrice DuPont of uh, Flux Studios in New York City and PureMix.net. Um, I had been talking to Fab, you know, for a number of years uh, at various trade shows and things like that, and we were just acquaintances, you know, casually having lunch together and things like that. And uh, I was looking to design a new, you know, modern microphone that, you know, was going to, you know, fill a void somewhere or, you know, stand out from some of the other ones out there because there are a lot of, you know, large diaphragm mics. And in my conversations with Fab, one of the things he expressed was he had a really hard time finding a modern, you know, FET microphone that he really liked. You know, he had his Vintage 47 and he's got a plethora of, of you know, other microphones in his studio. And one of the things he said is that everything was so you know, so open and bright nowadays. And the signal chain that he even often uses is not necessarily, um, you know, going through a, you know, a vintage board with output transformers and preamps with output transformers and, and, and all this kind of stuff. He wanted something that, you know, he can run right into his UAD Apollo, you know, right into Pro Tools, whatever it is, and it sounds great right off the bat. You know, more of the modern day recording process that, you know, a lot of guys are doing in their home studios. So in, you know, in talking to him about this, he says, well, I want something that, you know, as Fab puts it, you know, I, don't, I want something that's not going to hurt my ears with a really loud female vocalist. So I, uh, I put together a prototype and kind of blindly sent it off to him. I literally just sent him an email saying, hey, Fab, um, you know, I'd like to send you something and see what you think of it. And, you know, he responded you know, shortly thereafter, said, sure, we get stuff all the time, send it. About a week later, I heard back from him. He said, very interesting, but can you do this? You know, he wanted to tweak, you know, 300 hertz there. He wanted to tweak between 5 and 10K and all this kind of stuff. And so, you know, to make a longer story short, we went through several iterations um, of this product and we came up with uh, three different versions that we really liked. Instead of making three different microphones, we decided that we wanted to try and put them all into one. So uh, let me get to what we did there in a second. But let me talk to you about a couple of the features of the Atlantis. One, it is a uh, large diaphragm. It has Loudon Audio's 38 millimeter capsule. It's capable of figure eight, cardioid, and omni switchable on the body. It also features a negative 10 dB pad and a plus 10 dB switch. Uh, you know, Loughton's idea behind the plus 10 dB switch was to allow uh, users to get uh, more character from the microphone and, and rely less on their preamp if they wanted to. You know, same thing with negative 10, you can turn negative 10 on, you can you know, increase the gain on your preamp and get more of your preamp character. Now you can also record louder instruments, or if you want to bring out more presence in something, you can use a plus 10. And the, the unique feature um, that Fab and I developed together was the multi-voicing switch. This is where those three iterations of the microphones that we really liked, we wanted to put it into one. So what we have here is a forward, neutral, and gentle voicing position. Uh, they're sort of self-explanatory. Forward is more open, more forward, you know, kind of along the lines of uh, the trend in a lot of modern FET, you know, condenser microphones. Um, and then the neutral and gentle settings give you more of that vintage classic without having to go through that, you know, transformer output uh, console, transformer output preamp and things like that. And it's not just an EQ. We're not just, you know, high passing or rolling off the top or anything like that. It's actually going through three different circuit paths and you get three quite unique uh, frequency responses from the microphone. Any additional information regarding the Atlantis, SoundPure does carry the microphone and you can contact them. Mm -hmm.